Hello and welcome to Midnight Guard Gaming. I'm your host, Mid, and this is a recording made on Friday, November 23rd. Uh, we are going to be playing some Division. Um, hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, so I what I'm going to do... you need to shut down. So what I'm going to do is... Let me get in the game first. Uh, or what we are going to do is... I've been running... Okay, come on. There you go. Um, I have been running survival matches the last couple days accumulating um caches survival caches uh because we're in the middle of a global event and what happens is when you get these i have 55 of them to be exact is if you scroll down you get 170 uh global event credits every one you open um so i have 55 of those so that's going to be a metric butt ton of points um what I'm working on is to get into the tier three, the third tier of the leaderboards for the global event, um, which is you have to get as high of an, av an hourly GE credit accumulation average as possible. Um, so what I'm going to do is for the next hour, I have a clock a timer set up off of my other monitor. I am going to run the weekly HVT missions um, I'm going to run all of those because if you look at those, um, I will get 750 G credits, 750, so that's 1500, and two at 550, so that's uh, another 1100. So let's see what it is. 750, 1500, 2600. And then another 1300, so that's a 39, uh, 3,900, and then another 400. So that's 4,700 GE credits. If I can get, I can get those done in about a half hour, I think, or a little bit over a half hour. Um, and then with the 55 survival caches, I'll open all those the, at 170 G credits of opening for that that's almost another 10,000 so I'm going to be at about 14,000 GE credits in under an hour and whatever time Stop. left I have after that I'm going to run the world bosses um, so I should end up well over 16 or like probably about 16,000 GE credits in an hour um, so that is my plan so in the credit of the counter I will not start my cl uh, counter stopwatch until I get close to the end of the first HVT that I'm going to do. Um, because it's when you actually earn your first GE credits, that's when that clock starts for an hour. So um, just getting on. So, all right. So let us jump in here. Incredible. I'm running my Nomad build. Um, so we're going to do Espadon. So this is first wave renegades are attacking GTF checkpoints, trying to break quarantine. Okay. So first off, let Got me look. You. Whenever you can take it on. Okay, my Phoenix credits are in a decent place. I don't want to overdo this with po if possible. All right, I'm going to go buy one cash real quick. Because um, I don't want to lose GE credits, and I don't know if they'll pile up on the floor or not if I over go over the 10,000 point limit. So I'm working on my Predator's Mark cash uh, uh, classified set, so I really want to get that. I'm missing two pieces to finish the set of that, although I am missing pieces of Reclaimers as well. Um, let's see. I'll buy the uh, classified reclaimers because the last two predator, uh, predators mark caches I bought, I've gotten the backpack which I don't need. Um, so let's open that cache real quick. So that's the holster. Let me check and see if that's what I need. Oh, that's not what I want my list up here because I've been tracking all this stuff um let's see so holster reclaimer's holster I don't need the holster damn okay I'm still gonna throw it in my stash though so let's just throw it in there because I'll, I'll see if I actually want to swap it for my other one or whatever it doesn't really matter um, let's see, holsters, boom, yeah, just chuck that in the stash. All right, so let's double check this again. Um, 
So down to 883. Good. All right. Because I can have a maximum of 10,000 credits. All right. Best gear in the city. Topped Check off with out. my ammo. All right. So we're going to go do this. I'm going to move quickly as soon as I start doing these. I want to try to get... I'm starting with the hardest and working my way down because they'll speed up how fast I can get them done as they get easier. Um, I, I was contemplating doing the dailies after that, but... They just don't... Yeah, that's the most she gets, 225. Um, I can get 150 for each world boss that I go through. I got lots for you to do when you have room um, for card, okay? So... See you later. Um, I can run the world bosses in... If I skip one of them, which is just kind of a pain to get to, I could do 14 of the 15 world bosses in about 20 minutes, I think it is. So, all right. So let's kick this off. We're going to do... Uh, let's see if I can get an idea. LMB squad is executing squatters to secure forward operating bases up around the city. Renegades attacking GTF checkpoints trying to break quarantine. Okay. So we're going to do this for him first. Blades. Um, yep. Intel says this one's a real fighter, but my money's on you. You feel like taking on a tough one? All right, so let's see where they're at. Oh, wow, they're right by. Okay, so I have a feeling I'm going to end up with a bunch of these right in this area, which is good. So then I'll just jump to this location. I run down the street. Um, I'm going to be use, like, utilizing a lot of fast travel because that's the way of getting around as quickly as possible between all the stuff you can earn global event credits with. Um, so this one actually is going to be more sniper-based. Now leaving the safe area. I'm going to take a position, take my time on this first one, and be very methodical and take down these guys from range. Because it's they're high-risk targets, so you want to minimize your exposure. Because um, you can easily get overwhelmed. And we have Onslaught, so... I kind of want to do... I'm, I'm preferring tear gas the the gas modifier because it is going to give Get out of here. because it will give me a nice interrupt it pauses them in sp in place so i can take them down quicker all right so we got that jump up here yep. approaching marked location Mm. All right, so the fuck are you doing here? these guys are all a bunch of turrets. I am very tempted, actually, to switch to my tactician build for this one. I think I'm going to do that. Because I could just hide up here and toss stuff. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. Let's switch to my tactician build. Reload, get my preferred. So sick of dealing with this JTF bullshit. Yeah, because that's a whole bunch of guys. There's like five guys who can make turrets over here, which is going to be a pain. We're wasting they just time stepped with in JTF, good. I swear. Alright, so let's see how many. Alright, so I took out two of them. Warning. Hostiles detected nearby. Oh, here come some guys from there. This is a good position just to be chucking stuff. Where are they? 
Oh, here they come. Okay, so I'm actually going to have to switch. Let me switch over to my... Uh... Oh, can't do that. All right. So I have to be careful. Shotgunners hate these guys. Actually gonna start my timer now. Took one. The value target has been eliminated. Need to collect all this intel real quick. I'm actually not collecting any of the gear unless it's a class of, or like a gear set classified piece. Nope. Actually, I will. We'll grab the mod. I don't care about any of this other stuff. I just have to move as fast as possible. Cycle through, grab as much things. There we go. Intel. And Intel. Okay. Back we go. I will inevitably end up back at these locations and I can always run them, collect stuff then. I don't really care at this point. I don't. It's all about speed. We got a serious threat I need. Yeah, no assignments right now. I'll work on it. Yep. Good luck. I hear you'll need it with this one. All right, where's it at? Okay, up here near Camp Clinton. Okay, this one I will be switching to my Nomad build because uh, this is inside. It's close quarters. Yeah, I, a tactician. It's too risky running my tactician. So I want survivability first and foremost. Okay, we got my my. Uh, 
Reload and get moving. We're at just about three minutes at the moment. Approaching marked location. Warning. Hostiles detected nearby. Okay, this is annoying. I hate grenadiers. Warning. Additional incoming hostiles detected.
target has been eliminated. Seven minutes. This one took longer. Yeah, these get a little bit hairy, so having survivability is the biggest thing for this. And I'm not the best at... I'm sloppy, so... <laughs> I'm not an expert at this game by any means. Any stretch of the imagination. Okay, so there was something down here, but I don't see it. Not a big deal. All right, moving. Got to get back. Hey. All right, so that's two down. We're at eight minutes, 30 seconds. Once I finish all of these, I will open all my caches real fast. And then I will start doing world bosses till the end of the time. Readings indicate this area is safe. Until the end of time. All right, so we'll do this. Heard some bad things about this one, but you should be able to handle it. Where is he? Over here. Okay, so we're going to jump to this location. Russian consulate, run down the street, get to that. No time for giving free stuff out. Approaching marked location. If we don't take shit around here, who will? JTF. Warning. Hostiles detected nearby. Where's this other guy at? He's underneath? Okay, there we are. Just shoot you in the groin. <laughs> Alright, so they're coming from over here. Alright, gotta jump down. That there. It's nice how these guys all line up nicely.
Hostiles incoming. Alert. Heavily armored hostile detected. Run through, gather, gather all the easy to grab intel. No classifieds. No cl oh, there was a mod. Okay. Moving out. Head back. Hey. All right, 13, 14 minutes, and we've got three done. They get quicker as we go because these. These, they just get drawn out, which kind of sucks. Um, I am going to restock my ammo real fast. Just be careful out there, okay? Good luck. And where is he? Is it going to be back in the same spot? Nope, it's down there. Okay, cool. It's right near the safe house. Excellent. Move it. It's like, yeah, for the time constraints using tacticians in this just isn't the best because it's so squishy and you end up having to move a lot. I keep funneling him into the, into the same area. Nope. Friggin' grenadiers. Hate these guys.
It's like, yeah, I am going to come back and grab stuff later, but I want to grab all the target intel I can. Just because I don't want to have to do that later. Alright, good. Alright. Back to the boo. Alright, we're at 1840. Gotta get rid of this stuff here. Because this is gonna fill up and then I'm gonna have some issues. So what I wanna do is just get rid of this junk. Alright, I got some field proficiency caches which I don't care about. making a big difference around the city, so thanks for taking that on. All right. These sh should go quicker. All right. Back up. To Ooh, that's actually a little bit south. Okay. As I say, same location as that other one I did, but nope. So it is south of me. Um, I want to say it's in a lot, uh, a parking lot down here, back lot. And if that's the case, I can actually get a nice above view. Yes, it is. Okay, I am actually going to switch to my tactician. This will actually be quicker. Because I can actually hide up on the rooftop Approaching marked location. and take all these guys down. These guys are all running around like chickens with their heads cut off. Like, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Uh -huh. Alert. Additional hostiles inbound.
All right, there we go. Actually, that was... That might be a uh, damage versus elite. I'll see. Don't care. to the boo 24 minutes so yeah these are gonna speed up the last couple agent let's talk got something new glad you're on it agent Okay, so this one kind of sucks. I may actually run down the street and kill the uh, the world boss down here, since I will be in that area. I have to run over this direction anyway, so. Yeah, I'm going to keep with my tactician's build for this. Uh, these are easier ones to do, if I'm careful. And this one I can actually hide within a uh, office building. Screw you! My kid needs food. No, screw you! Twenty-five coming up on twenty-six minutes. Glad you're okay. Actually, I'm not going to run down to that park. Um, just not going to waste the time doing it for one world boss. It's going to probably hurt me in the long, location. long run if I do that. Warning. Additional incoming hostiles detected. Oh. Let's get inside here. Shotgunner. Warning. Additional hostiles incoming. Hostiles detected. Alert. Heavily 
fully armored hostile detected. value target has been eliminated. Alright, there you go. Now... Twenty nine forty. Uh, I got two left, I think. Now entering a safe area. I feel like taking on a tough. This one, I'm actually going to switch back over to my nomad need the survivability. Getting a little too close on some of these, so... Alright. Where's this one at? Um... I can't wait to put my feet up... Okay, I can fast trample to this incursion. Cleaner presence in Hell's Kitchen. Something's up for sure. I don't like it. Look at over the... No, I don't. No. With them for your entry. We need those cleaners exterminated. Pride no. Home. I don't want to do the incursion. I just wanted to fast travel there. Trying to stay out of triggering the friggin' incursion. Alright, I gotta go down underneath. Good, okay. And we are at 3045. Approaching marked location.
additional hostiles incoming. One more, we're at 34. Yeah, this is taking longer than I anticipated. And I'm not even picking up stuff like I did last time, so. Back here. Excellent. Yeah, I'm going to be lucky if I get, if I'm close to 1500 or 15,000 uh, GE credits per hour on this one. Because it's just, yeah, taking longer than I thought it was going to take. But then again, when I open all these. Um, caches that's going to probably take me five to ten minutes to do real quick
Come on, dude. You're gonna hide. Warning. Incoming hostiles detected. Okay, he's Land. coming in this way. Heavily armored hostile detected. Intel, Intel. Okay, back to the boo. Hey. All right, so we got 20 minutes left. Um, I'll open all my caches when I get back here. First things first, I'm gonna go grab, buy whatever caches I can here. Uh, we'll do two predators marks. All right. And then I think that was all of them for her. Yep. Alright, so now we gotta go through and. don't care what comes out of these I just want to open them as fast as possible I'll go through the stack of stuff on the floor later So I do have to go through because I don't know if I leave the if I leave the boo if I will actually this stuff will still be here when I come back. That's sitting on the floor. On the ground. I'm not going to open the two gear uh, classify caches I got. Let's hang on to those for the time being. Be 
This is a lot of freaking caches. Got about 15 minutes left. Quickly go through. I'm not even looking at these weapons. I'm just getting rid of them. Could be the greatest weapons ever. I don't care at this point. Not my. I'm fine with what I have. Uh, ferocious. Yeah, we'll hang on to that one. Call through my tactician's backpack back into my stash, but apparently I did, because so I'm not seeing it here. Go through this, and we got 12 minutes to do as many other. Yeah, I'm not gonna look at those. All right, I'm gonna go grab a couple more caches because I know I'm at almost 10,000. Yep, uh, let's do Predator's Mark. Okay, and switch to. Because these just go quicker. All right, let's see how many we can do in 12 minutes. Could probably do about half these.
Warning. Now we're exiting the safe area. Okay. Uh, 11 minutes. Probably be able to get about five or so of them done. It's left fumes. Okay, well, there you go. Just grabbing everything off him, running away. Got shit aggro. Ten minutes. I'm going to end up at about 15,000 per hour. Classified set. Um, why am I pushing that? I want to go to here. So two bosses down. Now entering a safe area. Warning. Now leaving the safe area. Eight minutes left. Got seven minutes left. We are so grateful.
Next, that's four. One, two, three, four. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Yep. This will be five. We got five and a half minutes left. And yeah, the um, leaderboards for global events, those update 20, within 24 hours. So it'll be Saturday early afternoon when I'll see where I fall. I'm pretty confident I'm going to be in the tier three, so the top tier. I mean, with my math that I'm doing, I'm going to have right around 15,000 GE credits an hour for this past hour. You're not dying from that bleed. That's kind of annoying. Okay, four minutes. I could probably get these last two guys over here that are close together. I'll probably go a couple minutes past an hour on my countdown clock just to be on the safe side because who knows what when the timer exactly started because I want to make sure that I'm just not quitting and could have gotten maybe one or two more bosses world bosses out of the way. Yeah, this is going to be close on these two. I don't know if I'm, both these will count, but I'll be very close on them. Not as pretty as I was hoping. Okay, got about a minute and a half. And of course, 
I get that stupid combat bug because someone a block overheard the explosion. It's like, oh, we're aggroed. We don't, we're not going to move towards it. We'll just face that direction. Might be able to squeak one more in. Now entering a contaminated area. All right. Let's see if I can get this last one done within the next minute. Leaving contaminated area. This may or may not count. And that should be it. I'm not going to have time to get to another one, so... Even if I go another couple minutes, it's... Yeah, I, I'm not... It'll probably be just past, so... Alright, so with that, I'm going to take a quick break. I'm going to go clean up some stuff on my inventory since I have a ton. And I will be back to record some more stuff shortly. Probably do some uh, underground runs and stuff like that. So anyway, um, I will catch you again very soon. Bye.